Yo, what's going on my people? Today I got you guys a card duplication glitch working on the old gen version of GTA 5 Online. This is not working on the next gen versions. Uh, I will have hopefully a next gen glitch coming out within the next couple weeks. Now, if you are subscribed to the channel, you might realize that the video is actually a re-upload. I uploaded it like a week ago. The reason I'm re-uploading it is because the glitch actually hasn't been patched, so it's still working on the next gen versions. So, um, yeah, I didn't really see the point of re-recording the video and editing it up when I could just re-upload the same video because the glitch is the same. Um, if this glitch does work for you, make sure to comment it down below. And when this glitch does get patched, I will be um, pinning a comment in the top of the comment section saying it's been patched. So just check the comments. And if there's nothing down there saying it's been patched by me, then uh, the glitch is still working. But yeah, with all that said, uh, we're so close to 1k, so if you do like this video, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. But yeah, let's get straight into the glitch. Okay, so first things first, you're going to want to get your friend to get themselves glitched out. Uh, to get themselves glitched out, what they want to do is bookmark the job I have linked down in the description. They want to close their game and reload it, and once they've done that, they should have the mission I have inside their casino penthouse. I also recommend them not having any personal vehicles out while performing this part of the glitch. Okay, so all your friend is going to do is walk up to the phone and angle it so they have the open phone menu, request services, and once they click that, they're going to walk inside the circle. Now all you want to do is request uh, valet services and request a vehicle from your penthouse garage. Once you accept it, when your character puts your phone down, you want to hit right on the D-pad and you should load into the job and your screen should go to black exactly like my screen did there then you should see that your character is falling through the map and then once you spawn on the ground you just want to cook a grenade or throw a c4 just to test if you're in god mode like i do on screen and if you're in god mode then your friend has done this part of the glitch correctly and now we're going to cut to the duper's perspective okay so now all you're going to want to do is go to your phone go to your mechanic and just request a vehicle from any garage. Another thing you want to make sure is that on your vehicles, you want to have your vehicles set to passengers because if the glitched out person sits in any driver's seat of any vehicle, it will uh, unglitch them and you will have to restart. Once your car spawns in, all you want to do is tell your glitched out friend to hop inside, but make sure you have it set so he can only get in the passenger seat, because if he gets in the driver's seat, it will ruin the glitch, and he has to restart and redo the glitching out method. Once your friend has got inside of your car, all you want to do is run far enough away to where you can open up your MC menu and request a Fagio that is stored inside your penthouse garage. Once you call the Fagio, you should see that the Fagio hasn't spawned in. If it spawns in, you need to restart, but if it hasn't spawned in, all you want to do is walk inside your penthouse garage. So once you get inside your penthouse garage, you should have the vehicle you want to duplicate, so that's the Izzy Classic for me, a vehicle you don't mind losing, and obviously the Fagio. But once you hop inside the Izzy Classic, you should realize that you're able to drive it around inside your penthouse, so all you want to do is drive it to where I do on screen, near the door, and you want to angle it to where the passenger or driver's side door is being blocked by the, the exit. This might take a few tries, it did take me a while the first time I did this, but once you've got it done, all you want to do is run and hop in any other vehicle and just park it up against the other door, blocking both doors. Just park up like you see I've done on screen. Now all you want to do is run up to the Izzy and click uh, triangle. Uh, or whatever the button is to get inside. If you teleport inside, that's perfect. Now all you want to do is angle yourself so you see this menu on the screen and then click X and try and go at the same time to teleport inside and exit. Once you have made outside the casino, all you want to do is open up your phone, call your mechanic and request uh, a free car elegy from any garage. Once you request a free cut elegy, you should see that it hasn't spawned in. Now all you want to do is wait 10 seconds, and then once that 10 seconds is up, tell your friend to get out of your other personal vehicle, and you should see it disappears. It teleported me because I got too close, and I didn't realize, but that's fine. All you want to do is just turn back around. It was right there, and then just tell him to get out after the 10 seconds, and you should see the vehicle will fade away and disappear. 
Once the vehicle disappears, all you need to do is drive to the back of your MOC and store this vehicle inside. And there you have it, you have successfully duplicated one car. Now I will be showing you uh, how to rinse and repeat this. So all you want to do is bring this vehicle outside of your uh, MOC and tell your friend to get back inside. Then all you want to do is uh, run away again, open your MC menu, call in a Fagio, and then go back inside of your penthouse garage, and then you know the rest of the steps from there. Get inside the Izzy Classic, pull it to the door, park the other car up against it, make sure you can teleport inside, all of them steps, you know, just, if you don't know, go look back at the video, but it's as easy as that. So I hope this video helps you guys out, it helps you duplicate them cars. One thing I should say, this video, it was recorded on Wednesday, the 23rd of March. Tomorrow is Thursday, so that's when the updates come out. So if you're seeing this on Thursday onwards, check the comments. Uh, I will be pinning a comment as soon as this glitch gets patched, because I'm going to be doing this glitch basically daily until it gets patched. So yeah, um, check the comments. If there's no comment there from me saying it's been patched, then it, it's working. Um, but with that said, I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.